welcome back to my channel. Today is a favourites video for you. It's a big mix of stuff that I'm enjoying, Isla's enjoying, Lachlan's enjoying, not what Rob's enjoying actually. I forgot to ask him this morning and I'm doing this really quickly because I'm going out for lunch so sorry if I'm like oh. But yeah, let's start with my favourite stuff. It's also a very big mix of random stuff like house stuff, beauty stuff, bit of fashion stuff. This is a bit of a mix. Oh, and also there are no ads, there's no nothing. I bought this all myself. So um, first of all, these Method cleaning products. So just a bit more natural than your standard stuff. So the Method Concentrated Laundry Detergent in, P I always say this wrong, Peony, Peony Blush. Really nice, smells lovely. And um, I'm like, oh, that's like, I've had it for about a week and that's how much I've used and I did a lot of washing. And then they're washing up liquid, which is clementine. I was gonna say flavored, but you don't eat it. Clementine and scented. Some of their products I'm finding a bit overwhelming, like smell wise, like the rhubarb spray stuff is too much for me. So if anyone needs one of them, I have one in my cupboard, but I really like their lavender spray as well. I'm enjoying these L'Oreal hair expertise, the sulfate free shampoo and conditioner. It's a pure strength shampoo. It smells lovely. And the water where I live is really, really hard. It's horrible, horrible water compared to back home in Scotland. So I find shampoos tend to like build up a lot on my hair but so far this stuff seems to be pretty good. I can't remember how much it was. I think I got it on Amazon Prime and it was like five or six pounds, something like that. And then the Pure Rich Conditioner basically got this one instead of the matching one to this one because it's the only one on Prime and I'm really impatient. Absolutely loving my Ralph Lauren Romance perfume this month. I've worn this for years and years and years and it always reminds me of my dad because he was the first one that ever bought it for me. And I kind of like go away from it and try others and then come back to it. It's just a really, really lovely, light kind of floral scent. Really good for everyday wear. I absolutely love it. I got this, this is gonna be hard to say, this This works in Transit Skin Defense little um, moisturizer in a birch box, the um, Mother of Daughters birch box I got sent. So it's just a little one, but I really, really like it. It's really good. I'm quite fussy with moisturizer and um, kind of expect a lot from it. I know that sounds really silly for like a moisturizer, but I don't like it to be too heavy, but I don't like it to be too light. I like to know it's on my face, especially at night. And yeah, this stuff's really, really nice. And I'm finding like my skin is so much better in the morning when I have it on overnight. I do think it's a daily moisturizer, not a nighttime one, but I like it at night too. I got this Armani kind of eyeshadow thing free when I bought a foundation and it's lovely. I couldn't tell you, or maybe if I can read it, eye tint, that is like the smallest font in the world. It says eye tint fluid, eye colour, this is like an eye test. I can't read the rest of it. It's in shade 12. It's very gold and it's lovely. It's so nice. It's a really nice one for kind of like during the day. God, it's not going on it now. Hmm. But yeah, it's like that kind of brush. And it goes on really lovely on your eyes. Candle wise, always feel like I need to include a candle in my favourites. I say that, I've only ever done one favourites video. But this is a Coast Candle Company candle. And they're basically, they're made up in a place called Dornick, which is where my granny and granddad lived. And they have this lovely little shop kind of on the corner. It's a really, really small town. And um, yeah, you can like, they've got so many different scents and you can try them all. It's very Instagram friendly, beautiful. And then they also have a little workshop off to the side where you can do like candle making classes. So I definitely have to get up there for one of them. But this is the Drift Away one. And it smells like a spa. It's like really lemony and fresh. That's what I like from a candle. I don't really like a heavy musky candle. So yeah, Coast Candle Company, Drift Away candle. And then some fashion bits from me. I'm loving my denim jacket. I got this from H&M. I think it was about 30 quid. And I've just worn it so much, even though the weather's been a bit dodgy again. But I can't remember the last time I wore a denim jacket, like probably when I was 16 or something. But I'm really, really loving it. Isla has a very similar one because I do like to twin. Yeah, it's just a kind of really fitted, not cropped, normal length denim jacket. These sandals from Primark were only three pounds and I really have to go back and get them in like a million billion colours because they're so good just for like skulking around like just in the garden or going popping out to the shops or just yeah if it's really nice weather they look nice with dresses but three pounds. And then lastly in my kind of fashion bit my little Prada bag that I got for my birthday earlier in the year um, because obviously I've had the two kids with me on maternity leave for ages I've not really been able to use many handbags but they're at nursery full time now because I go back to work next week so I've been really enjoying using my handbag finally. I got it in Mr Village like at a really good price if anyone's wondering. Mr. Village is awesome. So that was my bits, now a few bits from Isla. She's really enjoying this book we got sent. So actually it's not an ad, like I know I said no ads earlier, but this isn't like an ad, I'm not being paid to do this, they didn't ask for this or anything. But um, they just sent it to us and it's called Superstar Kids and it's rhyming moral fun. And it's quite good, it's a bit different. It's um like just got loads and loads of stories actually. Lots and lots and she seems to be quite into it. I bought her this swimming costume from Mother Care the other week, even though we haven't even booked holiday yet. But look at it, is it not just like the cutest thing in the world? It's the M by Mylene class, whatever it is, her range. 
and yeah it's just so cute it kind of like even reminds me of a kind of mini ravini print or something like that but i love it i would like one in my size this cardigan is saying so boring it's just a zara cardigan but she seems to want to wear it with everything and i love it because it goes with everything and she's at that stage where she wants to wear like really ridiculous stuff so the fact that she really likes this makes me very happy and randomly she wanted to include her goggles because she's obsessed with them literally obsessed she had a pair down here for swimming she does independent swimming now and then um, she's got a pair up at my mom and dad's and she stole the pair from my mom and dad's and brought them back down to Scotland, uh, down to Scotland, down to England, back here. But she like wears them everywhere. We found her in her bed wearing them. So yeah, I love goggles. And finally onto a few bits for Lachlan. His is very food based because he's a baby. Um, we are enjoying the babies. No, nope, that's not how you say it. The babies pouches because they're just, they're all dairy free for a start, which is wonderful. And um, yeah, they're just really interesting flavors. We're also really enjoying Ella's Kitchen and what else? Oh, Piccolo, of course, love them too. Um, I'm finding though, we're getting, now we're getting to about, he's eight months, last week. He's really enjoying eating actual food as well. So these are really good for when we're out and about and things like that. But when we're at home, he's loving having like proper bowls of pasta and like um, bolognese and just other stuff that we're having, but in like a kind of baby version for him. Breakfast wise in the morning, he is a big breakfast boy, which is great, he fits into our family very well because we all love our breakfast. So I bought this um, organics, raspberry and banana muesli. It does say 10 months plus, but he seems to be really bored of the really like non-textured stuff, if you know what I mean. So these both have like little bits in them of grains or whatever. So it's the Ella's Kitchen strawberry raspberry porridge. And yeah, this organics one. And they both have like, you know, the allergen advice. This one doesn't say anything about milk, but this one says that it may contain because it's like in a factory or whatever, but he seems to be fine with it, so that's good. And then lastly for Lachlan, I really, really like these little shorts I picked off at H&M the other day. Um, they're just so cute. They're just really cute. Not much else to say about them. Lachlan is also at the stage where he's absolutely loving his jumperoo. We've done a full review on it on another video, so I'll pop the link to that below. But yeah, he's really enjoying being upright, jumping about on that bad boy. We are also enjoying our Google Home, which is so much fun. You can go like, hey Google, play Ed Sheeran. Okay, here's Ed Sheeran on Spotify. When I was six years old, hey. my Okay, Google. Stop. And it's just really helpful. I never thought I'd be a fan of one of these things, but yeah, really loving it this month. And this Aden and Anne, if that's how you say it, Aden and Anne, a massive big swaddle blanket, especially with the weather, the way it is just now, swaddle blankets seem to be a better way to go than big thick blankets. So we got a pack of three of these and I really love stripes. This is my favorite one. And yeah, that's it. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this video. I know favorites videos are a bit like love or hate them, but I enjoy doing them. I enjoy watching them. So I thought I'd try them out for a little bit. But yeah, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. I will see you soon. Bye.